Hello YouTube and welcome to this video. What I'm going to teach you guys how to do today is um, I put a video of people to request tutorials but nobody did so I'm going to pull a video down I'm just going to make tutorials as they come to me. Um, what I want to show you guys is if you ever build a site especially if you're a beginner or intermediate web designer and you're not too familiar with PHP and you build a, a site let's say this is a site and this is your navigation bar we have two pages Oops, jump into design um, design view. We have two pages. This home page. This one says, "Hey, I'm the home page and the contact page." So, and you have a menu bar. If I change anything, if I change, say, let's take the S off that and jump to the contact page. See, the S is still there. Nothing's changed. You know, it, everything is just the same. And you have to go through every single page in your website and change this. So, I'm gonna show you guys how to render this in with uh, with a, using a simple file, using a PHP. So, you change one file and it updates throughout your website. So. Let's jump into code view, the contact form, which, uh, you know, let's just make sure I select the right one here. So let's jump into here and I select the, you just select the div where your uh, navigation bar is um, located. And I'm going to cut that out, take it out completely. Now we're going to go file, we're going to go new, we're going to make sure it's a PHP file, you create, and we're going to get rid of everything that's in here. We're going to paste this in and we're going to save this. So I'm going to click save. And inside my folder, I'm gonna name it menu and save. What? Yes. So save. Anyway, <laughs> now let's jump into uh, the index page, and we are going to select the same thing from our index page, but this time we're gonna delete that. Okay, where we delete our navigation bars, we're going to type a simple PHP uh, string in here. So we're going to say right angle bracket, we're going to say question sign PHP space I N C L U D E. So include once, oops, can't spell once, include once space quote, and we're going to say menu.php because that's what our file would make it a PHP file space question mark right angle bracket to close it up just for the heck of time I'm just gonna copy this jump into the contact form page and I'm just gonna paste that in where we delete the menu bar I'm gonna click save all jump back to design view and as you can see our menu bar is loaded right here from and it's pulling everything out of this menu.php so let's say oops contact locations menu.php code view Let's change the locations to say contact and we're going to save. Let's jump into contact. See, it's changed to contact. Let's jump to your, uh, your home page. It says contact. So it changed dynamically. All you have to do is update one single file and every navigation bar throughout your website is changed. And I'm going to go preview and live view. Uh, no, I don't have a server set up so it won't show me, but that's how you do it guys. It's pretty simple. It's pretty easy as you can see It's a painless process and uh, You just have one file to edit and, not, and don't have to pull your hair out when you have to change something in your contact form So I hope this helps you guys and I hope this will make your design uh, process a lot easier. So happy coding. See you guys later